Good morning, everyone. Here we are today. <coughs> so bottom line is, woo! <laughs> yep, this just went to the first target. That's okay. Um, apparently, this is going without us. <laughs> Something's up with Orbis, because this didn't show up on mine, and it showed up on a bunch of yours then. I'm like, what the heck? <coughs> oh, gosh. i got to get a water. Just give me one second. All right, here I am. We're gonna do this, but the numbers are gonna be different than what I said. So just roll with me with it. <coughs> right in the room if you did Netflix and the option I called, yay! Right in the room if you did it. Crazy town. Tayoga did it. Dubods did it. <coughs> I know Galahad did it. Did you get out of it, Galahad? Or did you stay with it? <coughs> Bob is up again, I think. Let's look. Gypsy's in it. Okie doke. So, market's very bullish. I feel like a broken record, but it's true. And we're living in a power trend here, power trend environment for the, sh for the longs, <laughs> which is why I keep calling trade after trade after trade. And yet, somehow, we're making money in shorts. Good job yesterday in UAL, did go to the dream target. Did anybody hold it all the way down or do it again? <coughs> I would watch Netflix today. If you didn't get out of it yesterday, it may not go immediately. Market may not go immediately either, or it might. Market may take today and tomorrow to have another leg up, just so you know. <coughs> so all the numbers I gave on this are off. I'm gonna look for new numbers here, and you're just gonna have to roll with me because I don't really have time to figure them out. <coughs> I think you got to give yourself two trades in this. Or maybe not. Okay, NWL. Okay, stop is going to be 28. I'll just wait. Don't do anything and just don't do anything yet. Stop is going to be 2820. 83 by 20 if it hits. NWL. And don't jump the gun on this. Eighty-three by twenty. And I really am gonna wait until it hits. In fact, let's put it at twenty-five. Eighty-three by twenty-five. And if that's off, I'll let you know. It's still on. Here we 
here, do it if you want to. Get, just take it. Take it and put the stop at 25. Yay, to do ba da Get the stop in at 25. I don't think we need it necessarily, but put it at 28, 25. Wait, that wasn't jumping the gun. It was just seeing it was going to break. You got to be in it if you want it. Here it goes. NWL down to $27. Let's see if we can get it down. Hope everybody got it. Shoo, it was right on top of that, baby. Here, NWL, 27, 2745, 27.50. Here we go. Holy crap. Yay, here, here. Oh, here it is. Here, you can take it out if you want right there. Oh my God, it is going to go to 27. Here, 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 here. Holy crap. Here, I'm out. I took it. I took it. I'm out. I'm out. Jeez. I, I, I got out of it. Oh my God. <laughs> here, it's at 27. You got to wash 27 for a bounce. I just, that was too big of a bar. Take it over too quick. Yay. Are you sure you people want me to trade tomorrow when I'm going to be on no sleep? I mean, I have just been spot on. In fact, I went back and looked, there's only been two losses this year. Are you sure that you want me to trade tomorrow? Because we've had two losses in 2018. Literally, that's how good I've been. Man, woo. Yes. This could have another entry. And there it is. It went to 230. All right, let's look at the market. Oh my God, it's 9.33. <laughs> uh, if only today was tomorrow. Here, let's look at this. I could go back to bed. Um, nothing here, nothing here, nothing here. Let's see what Kat is doing. Nothing here. Let me look at these ones here. Let's look at this thing here. Let's look at GE. It's falling off a cliff. Do. Don't bother to stay in bed. <laughs> Another great call. A whoop who? I I took it before a trigger because I saw it would break. That was that was that was a little gutsy, but I'll go over it in a minute. Um, but I gave it five more cents. Then what, here we'll go over. Is anyone still in it before we go over it? This very well could set up again. Did anyone not get it? I think everyone got it. It's still going here. It's gonna break twenty seven. Holy crap! Is anyone? Still there it goes. $26 could even happen today. But I don't know if it happens in the morning. Why would you still be? Here, it's still going. $26.84. Holy crap. What a great call. I thought that would bounce up hard. It didn't even bounce. In fact, this is swishing. It's swishing now. So, but, you know, let's just watch it. The Clips Trader still in a great call. It's, how could you still be in it, though, after this? If you still weren't in, in here, look at that. To get that so quickly and that nice sell-off. That's, if every day was like today. <laughs> if only. Here, it's still going. Here. Do, 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 do. Here. Oh, my Lanta. <gasps> Holy crap. Look at it. 26.50. It's, I, I mean, it, I said it's swishing. Here, here, look at this. Wow. Yeah, Bob, you put it in the room and so did Dubods. So I, it's Bob actually and Dubods were the ones, both of you put it in the room at the same time to look at NWL. I did not have it on Orbis. Um, so Dubods and New York City Bob uh, really were the ones that put in here for me to watch this. They both said it at the same time, and I didn't have it on Orbis. I probably would have seen it later, but I might have looked it along. But I really wasn't crazy about the longs then, after I did spend about 10 minutes scanning for bullish watches. For some reason, Orbis scanning hasn't been that great. I have one more place I can check. I didn't do it then, because when Bob and Dubod said uh, this, I clearly saw it was good. And it rated 22 points. I would get out of this, though, if anybody was in it. If anyone at all was in it, the stock just moved $2. You must get out. <clears throat> that is a huge call. And if you got out here or if you got out here, it's huge no matter what. I, I really wouldn't still be in it, but it's still going. Is anyone still in it? Gypsy's out. Koala Bear's flat. Pyramid 523. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't know why. I mean, that's twice in the last week that this had, 
I think this there's there's something going on here because they're not coming up in the in the way that they used to so quickly. This was a late gapper. It w it was late this morning, early at eight thirty, with very low volume. More wow is right. It wasn't on Mountain Girl screens either. Yeah. Javad's is saying it's an all day bleeder. I don't think I'm going to do it again. It's really just collapsed, and I'm very happy with my morning. But if it sets up again, I'll call it again. Did anyone not get it? I think everybody got it, right? It's still going. Holy crap. Yep. So it, this may just sell off right straight down. I do, Here it goes. It's going to break 26. I think it's a good idea for, for everyone to put ideas that they see in the room because of the fact that, um, you know, I may miss something because it may not come up on my scanner. So, oh, my God. Look at that. Holy crap. Oh, Galahad, you didn't do it? You could have, you could have, you could have, I, you could have just got it late. Just let the order sit there and fill your press with a different ECN. It's going to 25. This is insanity. <gasps> it's going to go $3 from the point I called it almost. No, it's going to go three. Here, it's going to go right down to 25. <laughs> so it's swooshed, but we're, I don't think we're going to get another play in it now. I don't see how. This is institutional selling, by the way, people. There it is. All right, we played it aggressive, which I was prepared to do. I warned you. I said we might need two trades in it because I wanted to be aggressive, but we didn't. But I wanted to be aggressive in it, but I knew that we might need two trades in it, but we didn't. Anyways, do Bonds and New York City Bob put ideas in the room every morning? Not have all of you do. You're welcome to do that. It doesn't mean I'm going to like your picks. Sometimes I like things they put, sometimes I don't. But there are two traders that put ideas in the room, so you certainly, everybody can do that. If you've got a separate scanner, you might see something that I don't see. Galahad, occasionally you put things in the room. Um, I think everybody's out. And I don't see how anyone could have gotten down to 25. But if you did, good job. Because really, how could you have held through this green bar? This is 50 cents. And the move was John Mungo from there. But it is clearly going to go to 25. And it looks like it's even going to break 25. If you got filled late, it didn't matter here. And even if you get filled late on any time I make a call, you put the stop in and you let it ride out and you can shave some off. If you've over, it's gonna break 25. The momentum in here is so big, so fierce that it's it's just kept going. But anyways, if you get a late call and you get filled, if, you, if you're oversized, just get the stop in, shave some off quick which you would have done with a positive gain of whatever you would have quick got out of some of it, and then ride the rest down normal. Big Fudge used to work for this company. I don't know what it is. All right, right in the room what everybody made in that trade today. I want to see everybody's numbers. You got to make the money real for yourself. What did everybody make in NWL today? Write it in the room. I want to see these numbers. Write it, write it, write it. This is, should be a decent day for every person, no matter where you got out. That first drop was a big sell-off. If the fact it continued, if you didn't get that whole thing, don't worry about it. Here, it just broke 25. There it goes. This is a goner. This could even go to 23-something today. I'm not saying this morning but by 10, but it is gone. 255 bucks, 11, 1,142. 500, 600, 1.25 hours. I don't know what that is. Uh, 360 bucks. Two grand. Good job, Dubods. Dubods is the winner here in the room, 2,000.
I don't know if we're, I don't think it's gonna, I don't think it's gonna reset up again here yet. I mean, anytime this morning now, it's gone too far. It's, it looks like it's just gonna keep strolling straight down. So I thought maybe we can get a second trade in it, but at this point now, it could be lunch, 11 o'clock, till it resets up again. Or like Dubai said, it may bleed all day. Yeah, it's crazy. So it did move more than $3 from where I called it. That's insanity. But this was a great move right in here. And real money so quickly. It never bounced back. So let's see if this is the, the morning area. 24.68. Have I ever seen a stock drop this much so fast before? Yes. A million times. A trillion. In 10 years of trading, all the time. Not so far this year. <clears throat> But I told you the market was going to take some time today. So I, the market is higher. I said it's going to take some time here to get going. And it might need till tomorrow. So for those of you that are in the Netflix, which gapped up, oh, it's just going. What? Another just freaky call I made that's so crazy good. So how, how much is everybody up in the Netflix option? If you're new, you may never have, Steve. I forget. I think you did the class in December. Debods is up 2K in the Netflix option, so you could get out of it and have a $4,000 day. That's not half bad. So people don't make that in a, in a month trading. You made it in a day. Oh, you did. You got out of it. Oh, you're out of this? <laughs> Gypsy's up $4,440. Woo-hoo-hoo! Wow, so many people are really getting gutsy. Holding them. Because you were up a lot yesterday into the rally, into the close. What is just super duper amazing to me is that we have picked, I mean, I have picked just the absolute right things to short in 2018 in a power trendy bullish market. And we've stayed away the days when there has not been good shorts, thank God. Um, and at the same time, I've called some huge bullish calls in the options letter. <laughs> and it's like, I mean, the fact that I can see both directional biases so clearly is 10 years of trading nothing but gaps in my own method. I mean, I'm so proud of myself because, you know, like there were so many people that thought this Netflix would collapse after that day on the day. After the day, I mean, I was so certain in the call I gave everybody and not surprised at all that it lifted over the high so quickly. And that was really on its own yesterday because the market fell at some point yesterday, you know, retraced, but this just kept going of its own momentum on its own completely. Tayoga when I got out of Netflix yesterday made two grand. That's amazing. I think Netflix is going to go to the dream target. It could even go beyond that because of the time amount that I gave in that trade a month, which it clearly did not even need, but you never know. Does anyone going to do another trade in NWL if I see another setup? I don't know if I will by 10, but we can watch. It's 15 minutes away. I'm happy with my day. I did not know that it was going to go to 24 something, or clearly I would have held it a little bit longer. But it was enough money right there so quick, I had to get out. And I thought it would reset up quick, but it didn't. So this is completely gone, and let's take a look at it. Uh, Steve is going to do it? All right. If something does something like this, and then the numbers I give are off, I just kind of roll with it, and that's what I did, and it worked as far as for us to get in. Um, you know, I just don't know what else this does here this morning. So I'll watch it, but no guarantees that I'm making, <coughs> excuse me, that I'm going to make another call. <coughs> and if this rolls over right here, I'm not calling this. I don't think it's enough of a bounce. <coughs> Fred made 2,800 in what? In, in NWL or Netflix? 
Fred, those are some big numbers you're putting on the board. <coughs> Fred made 2800 in NWL. That's really terrific. Fred just did the class. That's freaking amazing. Um, okay. So, yeah, I, I'm done for the day, I think, too. Just because I have a lot to do today to get ready for tomorrow. And early bedtime for me. But this could set up by 10. I'll, we'll sit here and watch it. Let's look at what's out for tonight. Oh my gosh. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta take a break. They want me back with new Neil Cavuto and I have to. Oh my God, 1225? It's not, I gotta go. I'm sorry. They want me to be on today at 1225. Holy crap. <sighs> I gotta go. I gotta go, people. I just saw my email. I'm sorry. And I don't even know if I have time to take a shower. <laughs> I'm sorry. I gotta go. I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. You're on your own in this. You know what to do. You know what to do. Everyone here has done the class. All right. I'll talk to you later.